Hey everyone and welcome back to Grimata and I am going... What the fuck? <laughs> hey everyone and welcome back to Grimata and we go straight downstairs into the office. Um... Private lab. Um, okay, so we have a fucking ass. So that takes the important away again. I was thinking, at the very first I was thought, I was thinking imposter. But imposter, then there would be like imposter. T E I. Yes, there would be one missing. And then I thought important, but now she puts me an ass there. I am P. Oh, impossible. S. Impossible? Is she trying to say it's impossible to come through? How is it? I am P L S S. It's not impossible. Accept. Ah? Huh? Eh? I don't know. Whatever. Whiteboard. Samantha saw Laura to talk. Okay, that's not different. That's not different. There's been a presence. Yeah, we know that. So, nothing. We have nothing. Give me no clues on what I am fucking supposed to do now. Don't you do that to me. <laughs> what do I do now? What do I do now? Do I scan? It's obvious. Scan it? No. <laughs> it's a scanner. Yeah, thank you. I know that. <sighs> then what? What? What are we supposed to do? I can't go in. Yeah, you can't go in there now. Ah, uh, where do we go? Let's check if we can see it again. I'm going to jump over it this time. There. How come it's only... How come it's only Angela this time? The activity is in the back half of the brain, the area associated with dreaming. She fell asleep. I'm not sure what part of the brain that is. It's too low to be the visual cortex and too far right to be the hypothalamus. There. There's the flare again. Mm. So it's still there. I can't really recognize anything. The flare is too strong. I should look at the previous frame. Why do we have the flare in session four, though? I guess we go talk to Angela. David, can I get you something? No, I'm fine. Okay, we can't talk to her. Um, then maybe... Mm. I don't know, I have no idea what to do now. Uh. Mm. 
Maybe he needs to see that she took the scooter? I don't know. Can you go in? No, you can't go. I've got no reason to go in the garage. I'm looking for Sam, and I can't see her hiding out in there. Oh, he's looking for me. That's just an old folly. It's been empty for years. You have no idea, mister. Back to St. Lemon Hall, then. Oh. Okay. Does anyone know where Samantha is? No. We've been looking for her. Tell them, Dr. Stiles. What happened at the cafeteria cannot have anything to do with us. I... I don't know. Listen, do any of you know anything at all about Samantha? I already told you, Dr. Stiles. She's not a student. Angela's been saying that. But it can't be true, can it? What kind of a person would make up something like oh, that? Oh, I'm sorry, a sneaky one. Come to think of it, she's too devious to be in anything but the law program. And if she were in it, I'd know. Do any of you have any background on Sam? Know where she came from? Did any of you know her before the experiment? No. But we did not know each other, either. That doesn't mean we're not students here. She stole my ID. I'll kill the wench. Oh, but don't you see? Sam could be dangerous. Oh, fuck you, bitch. If she could lie about this. Who knows what else she might be capable of? There is that magic of hers. I don't think it's right to use tricks on people when they don't even know you're a magician. What's this? Sam a magician? You mean a stage magician? With cards and... rabbits? Yeah, she's good, too. She hangs out at the Black Wand, the magic shop on St. Aldate's. All right. Listen, don't... don't talk to anyone about the experiment. Not until I've got back in touch. I've got to go. Yes? This is Rose Hall from the Virginia Department of Foster Care. Is this Dr. David Stiles? Yes, but I've already spoken to someone there. That was my assistant, and you left her in tears. You called about Samantha Everett? Listen, I've been Sam's caseworker for ten years. Despite what the asshole psychiatrist wrote, Sam is not a bad kid. She lived with five families in as many years, so yes, she's a little messed up. But she's smart and exceptionally gifted. I tried to talk her into college, but Sam had other ideas. I've gotten postcards from her from all over the world. It takes a lot of guts to strike out on your own like that. Is Sam in some kind of trouble? I'm afraid she is. Will you tell me about it? Not until I have all the facts. But I appreciate the phone call. I do have one more question. Is Sam a magician? Is she? Quite an amazing one. I fully expect to see her name in light someday. Or at least her stage name, Lady Byron. I see. You've been very helpful. Thank you, Miss Hall. I'll be in touch. Um, Oxford, I guess. Oxford Street, whatever, what is it called? Ta town Center. Time to find Mephistopheles. Wait. What? Lady Byron, command performance tonight, Deedless Club London. Well, now I know where to find Miss Everett. Unlucky for her. We don't even know this. Directory inquiries. How may I be of assistance? I need an address for the Deedless Club, London. I'm terribly sorry, but that number is X Directory. Hmm. Thank you. London clubs can be so ridiculously secretive. I need someone who could pull a private address. And I think I know who to ask. Detective? So we can't go in, I suppose. Or can we? They're closed. 
How convenient. I guess we called the... Uh... Yeah, you have a cell phone, but where is your cell phone, mister? Okay, I guess that's it. Um, we go home, call the detective guy, right? Yeah, we're done here. And I just run home to fucking call him when he's actually here. Detective. Yes. I need some information. Do you know of a place called the Dedalus Club in London? What for? I need the address. It's rather critical. Why don't you call Bloody Directory Inquiries? I tried Bloody Directory Inquiries. They don't have it. I thought the police might have heard of it. Uh, hang on. Not like I'm accomplishing a frigging thing here anyway. Why have to be so rude? Oh, we're friends. You're right. It's X Directory. Some kind of club. Here's the address. Thanks. I'm grateful. Just tell me if you hear anything, right? Of course. Not. So what, we can go there now? No, we can't. Then what do we what did what do we get now? Guess we just go home now? I don't know. This might be useful. Hmm. I'll compare this diagram to the brain scan image from the experiment. I'll need to take it over there. I'll take it with me. Yeah, you take it with you, David. Ugh. It's a scanner. We have it already? Oh, okay. And back to the monitor. Let's check Angela's brain again. I don't remember. There. Yep. And then what? Angela has activity in her massa intermedia just before the flare. That's odd. I'm not sure I remember what that area does. Or if it does anything. So, where are we going? So, we are going to find Sam? Like now? Oh my god, I don't know. What's going to happen? Just save the game, maybe. I don't know where we go. Where do we go in? There's nothing to check here, right? Oh well. Is he going inside though? It's a cafe. That can't be the. Oh, okay. Oh, what's going to happen now? There's a gentleman I've never seen before at the door. I came to see the show. Do you have an invitation? A token, perhaps? I have money. That's generally considered token <laughs> enough for entertainment. Ah, but this is a private club, sir. I'm afraid you'll need more than that. Ah. Oh. Um, I don't know. I'm here to see Lady Byron perform. She's a friend of mine. Ah, yes, I do see it now. How silly of me. Please, by all means, come in. Really? Dr. Styles. Oh, my God. Oh, I don't know how much longer this game is going to be. Is this the end? 
can't be, can it? We still, we still don't know what happened. I mean, what's going on with Laura and so on. Nice evening. Yes. Supposed to be a good show tonight, or an interesting one at any rate. Lady Byron? The club's a buzz. Word is, she's got a game going on up at Oxford. Quite a good one, too. Game? It's not what her game? game. A grand game. It would have to be good for the club to give someone like her membership. Street performer, you know. American. But from what I've heard, it might be at that. Wait a minute. Ladies and gentlemen, for our first act this evening, something fresh, something new in London town. This young magician has never before graced our stage, so prepare to be amazed, prepare to be enthralled and delighted by Lady Byron. Oh, very nice. Here now, Phoebus. Hold, hold, come. I don't think this is worth a standing ovation, or is it? According to what you hear of them. David, I mean, Dr. Stiles. You're very good. But unfortunately, the game you orchestrated will not work out as planned. What? Look, maybe I should have told you about... about my magic. But what's happening to you is not my game. I mean, how did you even... how did you... Find out? Not relevant. I know. And it's over. I can see how this looks. But I know who's pulling the game on you. I proved it today. If you just... Really? And you're a student at St. Edmunds, and an English Lit major. Oh my god. Drama! I have to admit, you were brilliant. Even hunting down my mother's necklace, just to make sure you got taken on. The funny thing is, you went to all that trouble, and there really is something going on at Dreadhill. And you with your ridiculous pranks at the track and pool. Ridiculous? Do you even know what would be involved? Those illusions were way beyond me. Stop lying, Sam. I called that foster care office, you know, found out something real about you at any rate. I could almost feel sorry for you. If you hadn't tried to ruin oh, your life. No. As for today, you're lucky no one was killed in that cafeteria. Did it not occur to you that someone could get hurt? Or were you too blinded by your big debut? I don't even know what you're talking about. All of your potential, and you throw it away to get into a damn magic club. I know you won't believe anything I say, but all I ever wanted to do was help you. Help me? Why would you? I want you cleared out of Dreadhill by morning. If you're gone, I might not turn you into the police. I never want to see your face again. My heart is breaking. Ah. <sighs> Damn it. Here we are at a dealer's club, and this is where I'm going to end this episode. I guess this is chapter 8 now, and I, I do think it might be the last chapter, right? I mean, probably. There's not much. I mean, there's, there's like the game of life. I'm Laura Styles. In the lion's den. Yeah, it's probably... I, I suppose it to be the end of the game. It's probably still not. I don't know. Um, like, subscribe, leave a comment. And I'm in the wrong direction again. Like, comment and subscribe if you haven't yet. And see you in the next episode, guys. Bye.